side up, take this side, fold it like that, and then fold it back like that. And you have a pocket. So then you fill it up like this. Don't overfill it, and don't underfill it. So you want um, enough kima. Then you take a little paste of white flour, and you use it as a sealant. Seal it here too. And then you push it over this side. There must be no holes anywhere. Make sure there's no holes anywhere. So the oil doesn't get in through. So I'll show you the second one. So take this side like this. Fold it over once. Fold it over twice. And then you have a pocket. And you'll have to do a third one too. Otherwise I don't think people will get it. Then you just put enough kima there, not too much, not too little. Seal it with some paste like that, white flour and water paste. Seal it on this side too. Cover it up like that. Make sure there are no holes anywhere. Like this, there should be no hole. Otherwise the oil gets in there when you fry. Okay, so we did three now, the fourth one. It goes pretty fast if you do it quickly. So you take this side, fold it once, then take this edge, fold it again. You have a pocket. You think you need a fifth one, Ali? Then put the quinoa in there, with all the spices and herbs, white onions, green onions, cilantro, and um, mint, ginger garlic paste, garam masala. Seal it, make sure there's no holes, make sure there's no holes. And we go to the next one. Again, take this edge, this straight edge there, the corners on this side, fold it once, fold it twice, you have a pocket. Seal it, one side, fill it, not too much, not too little. Because you don't want coming out of there. And then put some paste on this side, this side to seal. Seal it. Make sure there's no holes. Okay, that should be enough, right? Yep.